Aloha friends and welcome back. It's evening time now and we had quite a big day with baby Evelyn. So as baby Evelyn is slowly waking up, I'm gonna give her her passy and I'll tell you a little bit more about our day. There you go, sweetie. In our previous video with baby Evelyn, if you remember, she wasn't really feeling good. She was crying a lot, spitting up, not sleeping very well. And so I was going to town and I decided to see if we can find an opening with our doctor and see if she could see her, which she did. And I'll tell you about it in just a minute. And then we went shopping a little bit. It was quite rainy, so we didn't stay much and we didn't find much, but I did find a few little things, which I will show you in this video. Unfortunately, baby Evelyn still wasn't feeling good after we came back from town, so she needed a lot of attention. I carried her in the carrier most of the day and she had a really good long nap while I was doing my chores. And now she's waking up and I wanted to do an evening routine with her. So let's go ahead and unbundle her from this carrier bundle. Wake up, sleepyhead. It's time to eat and time to change you. Our baby was so comfy next to mommy and so warm that it takes her a while to wake up. Well, let me tell you a little bit of our adventures. So our doctor was very kind and she actually found an opening to check baby Evelyn out. We kind of combined it also with a well visit since baby Evelyn just turned three months and she is doing very well. So the doctor, of course, weighed her and checked her head circumference. She checked her heart, her lungs, her eyes, her nose, her ears. She got all checked out and she is doing actually quite well. So I'm really puzzled why she wasn't feeling well. The doctor said she might have colic she didn't think baby Evelyn had reflux. She did say it was possible, but we need more time to see how she's feeling. In the meantime, she told me a few things I can do to help her. So tonight we'll do a few of those things. One of the many things she suggested to do is a tummy rub, as well as the back rub. So I was thinking, maybe if I put baby Evelyn on her tummy, First of all, it may help her wake up faster. <laughs> and second of all, we can give her a little back rub. And of course, she said we need to do a lot of carrying in an upright position, especially if she's spitting up a lot. So that's why we spend a lot of time in the carrier. She thought a bath might help her. So we'll do a little bath today before bed. And she also said we need to be feeding her in more of an upright position, kind of like this, as well as put her to sleep in this position so she's not completely flat. So this way the food can be settled down in her stomach much better. So let's go ahead and undress her and take her to the bathroom for a little bath. And when we come back, we'll change her into comfy pajamas, get her ready for bedtime, feed her, and I can show you a few things that I got at Target while we were out. Here we go, sweetie, you're gonna feel so good. And maybe you can even sleep better tonight. Now that we know how to help you, here's our special towel. Here we go. Let's go take a bath. She's so cute. Look how precious. Let's wash those eyes and nose and your lips. Look at that little chin. Let's wash your ears. She's just really tired. But you gotta stay awake for your feeding. Let's wash your hands and your little fingers and your other little hand. 
You're going to feel so good. Here we go. What a sweetie pie. Good job. Okay, let's lay it back. Here we go. Well, I think it's time for us to go. Let me just go get our special hoodie towel. And we are back. Let's dry you off. Let's go ahead and put diaper on her. Here's our pajama that we'll be putting on her. Today I wanted to dress her in something a little more cheery. So I have this bright polka dot comfy pajama. It says very sweet with a strawberry. And this is a newborn size. We have been having a lot of rainy days lately, so this nice, bright, and cheery clothes really helps us to feel a little bit better. Right, baby? That's right. Here we go. Look how comfy we are. Aww. A few little snaps. And we're almost done. Almost ready for our bottle. Let's go ahead and put our little hat on. Oh, it's too cute, isn't it? Oh, you want your passy, sweetie? Here it is. I think she feels better. That's one of the things that doctor said, to let her suck on her pacifier more. And Evelyn really is not a pacifier kind of girl, but I'm glad that she's been taking it lately, so that's going to help her tummy. Okay, while well, she's nice and calm and not too fussy, let me go ahead and just show you the things we got at Target and then we'll feed her. All right, so here are the few things that I found at Target, really cute. And these are actually for our newborn twins. This is for a baby boy. And these ones are for a baby girl. Look how cute these are. First of all, they both have a white onesie with animals and plants on them. This one's for boy, this one's for girl, has elephants and kangaroos. This one has kangaroos too, and some other animals like llama. But anyway, I really love the colors that it comes with, like this almost like sage green and a blue turquoise maybe. And then I really love these colors. Look at this beautiful pink and this beautiful navy color. So I really like these and I can't wait to try these on our twins. And to go with it, I got the two packs of pants. So as you can see, these ones are for the girl. They have the pink ripped one and the other one with animals same thing here it's very very cute let me see what they look like actually <laughs> look how precious and this would go with this onesie obviously oh i just can't wait to dress them up in this anyways i did look for um like a sleeping outfit i try to get this out look at these ones i just really fell in love with these colors man could not pass by <laughs> you know what I mean look at that so beautiful so I was also looking for a sleeper that was ribbed like that with this color and this color I think in preemie size but unfortunately they didn't have it so I didn't get it this time hopefully I'll find it another time and then of course I had to get something for sweet Evelyn 
Look at this precious outfit. I just love this baby blue with flowers. It doesn't have any sleeves, so it's really summery. And it has these pants that match it and even comes with a cute little headband. Look how fun and summery that is. I can't wait until our baby feels better. And also when the weather improves here and it's sunny and warm, and when I can dress her up in this beautiful outfit and take her out, maybe for an outing or a picnic, that would be really fun. But for now, let's go ahead and get her bottle ready and feed her. Okay guys, so I got this bottle for Evelyn that's supposed to help her with her tummy troubles. It has this special device here that I think supposed to not let the air bubbles in. So let's go ahead and put our formula in, put some water in. By the way, the doctor also told me to try to feed her a little less and maybe a little more often. So we'll try that. I'm also going to add a little bit of medicine for colic in the milk. So hopefully this bottle will help her to sleep well tonight. Looking good. I think I hear Evelyn fussing. Let's go guys. Well, it sure looks like someone is really hungry, huh? Come here, sweetie. Let's get you some milk. Here we go. Here's your bottle, sweetie. By the way, another thing the doctor suggested is that I feed her a little bit more upright. And of course, we gotta burp her. So she doesn't have any of those air bubbles that are making her tummy not feel good, huh? She's doing pretty good as far as drinking enough milk. She's quite hungry. Shall we finish up, baby? Let's do it. I have to keep remembering to put her higher. I'm just used to feeding her like this. But this is probably better. Well, I think this is about as much as she's going to drink today. Here's your passy baby. Here you go. All right, guys, I think it's time to put her in her rocker. I think that's where she's going to sleep the best tonight. Here we go. Let me go ahead and swaddle her real quick. Because that was another thing that was supposed to be helpful for her tummy. I'm not gonna do it too tight, but just just enough for her to feel comfortable. There she is. Kind of tuck her in. There we go. Let's turn a little rocking timer on. Sweet dreams, baby Evelyn. I hope she sleeps well tonight. Well, friends, I hope you enjoyed this video with baby Evelyn and her evening routine. If you did, go ahead and give us thumbs up, share this video with your friends, subscribe if you're new, and we'll see you next time. Bye!